Hey everyone, this is Justin from Amplified Parts. Today we're going to show you how to wire up a 212 speaker cabinet in both series and parallel configurations. This is handy when you're building the new speaker cabinet and you got to match the impedance of your amplifier to the speaker cabinet itself. So when you get to the point of speaker selection for your speaker cabinet, you're going to want to make sure that you match the amplifier's output impedance up to the cabinet itself just because this helps with overall performance of the speakers working together with the amp and also it prevents output transformer damage if you have such a bad mismatch. So we got our 212 speaker cabinet that's loaded up with two Jensen Electric Lightnings at eight ohms. We're also gonna be using these little harnesses that I made up using our number 20 cloth covered wire and our Switchcraft mono jacks. I also threw some stake on spade connectors, whatever you wanna call them on the end just for the ease of you know, taking them off, putting them back on again. If I were gonna make this more permanent, I would probably just solder the connections. So we have our speakers mounted in this cab with the terminals up. That's mostly just for the ease of showing you how to do this. You can mount them with the terminals down, whichever way you prefer works. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna wire up the 212 cabinet first in series. Now this should give you, with two 8-ohm speakers, a 16-ohm load. We'll start by putting a single wire from the negative terminal to the positive terminal of the other speaker. So this is your first connection. Your second connection is gonna be the harness that has the jack on the end of it. You're basically just gonna hook the negative wire up to the negative terminal on this speaker, and then you're gonna hook the positive wire up to the positive terminal on this speaker. And there you have it. Next, we'll show you how to wire your cabinet up in parallel. So we're gonna use this twisted pair of wires to connect your positive and negative terminals on each speaker to each other first. So once you have this connected, this connects the two speakers, you're just gonna run the other wiring harness twisted pair from the mono jack to this speaker's positive and negative terminals respectively. And there you have it. This wiring should give you, at, with two 8 ohm speakers, a four ohm load. So that's about it. We showed you how to wire up your 212 speaker cabinet in both series and parallel configurations. You'll see from the diagrams that we flashed up on the screen that you have a few different options in terms of impedance based on the impedance of your speakers and how you choose to wire them up. Be sure to subscribe to our channel because next week we'll have another video. And you can also visit us at AmplifiedParts.com and check out our Tech Corner articles on speakers and speaker wiring. You can also find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr if you're feeling so inclined. That's all for now, folks. You have a good one.